Hello friends, welcome back. My name is PK. In this video, you will learn how to create beautiful 3D progress circle chart in Microsoft Excel. You can use this chart in your Excel dashboard to make it more beautiful and attractive. So I will explain you step by step how you can create this in Microsoft Excel. So let's start without delay. So let's add a new worksheet here and we will create our first chart from the scratch. So first we will create for the service level. So let's put here service level value and let's say I'm taking here service level value as 75% some random number. You can change it with your original number. In the next cell, I will take a support value for white area and that will be I'll use here 100% minus the service level value or we can put here 1 minus this service level value which is 25% okay if I will change this value as 30% automatically it will be changed to the 70% all right now we will go to the view and we will remove the grid lines from here and now we will go to the insert and we will insert our shape so go to the shapes and let's take this shape and just drag this shape here using the shift key so that it will be proper circle so it's a kind of donut shape and we will go to the shape format and the size of this shape we will take 6 by 6 so let's take 6 here and 6 here so 6 centimeter by 6 centimeter now our shape will look like this again go to the shape format and shape outline let's choose no outline shape fill you can choose any color whatever you want to take as per your dashboard theme so let's say here I'm taking this one for now now right click on this and go to the format shape here in the format shape we will go to the effects and we will go to the 3d format in the 3d format first of all we will choose here top people and let's take this one which is round and the width we will take 20 point for this top people and height we will take 20 point all right now we will go to the 3d rotation and here x rotation by rotation and z rotation we will put the values the value for the x rotation i will put here 340 for y rotation i will put here 327.3 and for the z rotation i will put here 31.4 and just hit the enter now our shape will look like this you can see here now select this range go to the insert and insert a pie chart here so we will take this pie which is 2d pie chart okay now go to this chart element button and remove the chart title and legend from here we will select the chart and go to the format and here we will change the size of the chart so we will take the size as 8 centimeter by 8 centimeter okay now our chart will look like this now select the chart and the shape together go to the shape format and go to the align and align this center and then align this middle okay now keep both the shapes here right click and make this group so that shape is behind the chart okay and chart is on the top of shape we will select the chart double click on the chart and then go to the format first shape outline choose no outline and shape fill as no fill now click on the pie and choose the shape outline as no outline now select the service level slice which is the blue slice the big one which is 75 percent so double click on these and then save fill and choose as no fill then you can see in the back end we can see our donut shape double click on this orange slice also which is for the white area and save fill and fill here white color now right click on this go to the format data point now in the format data point go to the fill and line and already we have taken the white fill here so just put the transparency as 20 percent here and just hit the enter so our chart is looking like this if i will change the value of service level as 20 percent then here you can see it's looking like it is selected 20 percent or 30 percent but let's put here random value between 1 to 100 percent then it is taking random values you can see now we will put the data label also so go to the insert and insert this word art just select this word art go to the formula bar press equal to and connect with the service level value and just hit the enter and let's keep this text box here in the center of this chart 
and increase the font size and change the font type as Arial Rounded Empty Bold. Take the bold here, take this theme color of the font color and let's keep it in the center. Increase the size a little bit more around 28. Now select this text box and the chart together right click and make it final group. Our chart is ready. Now you can hide this white area so you can change the font color as this white so it is not visible. Okay. Now similarly you can create the other charts also. Only difference will be you can change the color of the background shape as you want. Rest will remain same. Alright friends. So friends that is how you can quickly create the 3D progress circle chart in Microsoft Excel. You can use this chart in your project management dashboard to show the progress of your project or you can use in any kind of VI dashboard also which you are creating on the Excel. Friends I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you like this video please hit the like button and please subscribe my channel to get the regular update of my videos. Thank you so much for watching.